We've heard encouraging news from two of the front runners who are developing a COVID-19 vaccine, both uh, using genetic technology that's never been used before. Circle of Health reporter Denise Dora breaks down the science behind several different vaccine candidates. Weakened or inactive virus vaccines grown in eggs or cells are what we're used to. Now COVID-19 is about to take us to a whole new level in genetically engineered vaccines. The mRNA is really a novel strategy. Vaccine researcher Dr. Eric Dar says Pfizer and Moderna's mRNA approach sends an instruction manual to your cells, telling it to churn out a protein normally found on the coronavirus. It gets injected into your arm and then that will get expressed on the surface of the cell and the immune system will respond. Phase three results look promising, and because mRNA are just chemicals, they can be manufactured rapidly. The AstraZeneca Oxford vaccine Dr. Dar is testing uses a viral vector to deliver a bit of the coronavirus's genetic material into the cells. In this case, the vehicle is a cold virus. But the virus then doesn't replicate beyond that. It can get in once and then that's it. The delivery virus can't to make you sick, but experts say people might develop an immunity, limiting the ability to give multiple booster shots. The Subunit is the other big strategy, and that's the one that people are more sort of familiar with. Subunit vaccines are a more traditional method that delivers viral fragments to trigger an immune response. Novavax is using this type of vaccine. It's slightly slower to produce, but it's a tried and tested approach. Although two vaccines are nearing the finish line, scientists say we can't rest now. Multiple vaccines are needed to meet the global demand to help end this pandemic. Scientists still need thousands of volunteers to sign up so they can finish their work. A single vaccine is not going to be enough to interrupt transmission throughout the world. So it's in the interest of all of us to have more than one vaccine. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.